All right, what's up guys? Welcome to a brand new game. We're playing MX versus ATV Legends. Now, I haven't really played too much of this game before in the past, so I'm kind of coming in a little bit new, uh, but I have played games like this in the past, like Motocross Madness and stuff like that uh, way back, but it's been a long time, so I'm gonna be a little rusty. I've just went through the tutorials and stuff like that. It'll take us a little bit of time to get into. If you have any tips, tricks, comments, uh, leave it down below and I'll be happy to read them. But uh, yeah, let's start up a career. If you wanna see more, let me know. No, I am going to be quite busy because I'm going to be playing F122. Um, I'm going to be playing uh, this new Red Out 2 game. I'm enjoying playing that. And of course, the golf and MLB and FIFA and Gran Turismo. I'm playing loads of shit. So uh, yeah, shout out to Stephanie at Dead Good Media for sending out a code. Uh, very much appreciated. Let's do this thing. Career MX ATV. I kind of almost want to try like a UTV or an ATV. Well, I guess I got to start with the MX though, right? We got to start with the MX. So can you come back out and just go into the ATV? Will it be different? Okay, so you have to actually do some of the MX career before you can unlock the uh, the ATV and the UTV. That makes sense, actually. Okay, so let's do the Pine Hill Amateur here. I wonder when you unlock Moto it, like how long it takes to unlock it. Oh my god, it's the frames are life. terrible there. Bikes, Whoa. ATVs, UTVs. What is with this cutscene? in the mud and in our hearts. The feeling you get off the start line. The rush you get in the air. The feeling of the engine in your bones, the competition nipping at your heels. The best of us become the greatest. The best of the greatest become legends. But none of them start out that way. Legends aren't born. And there's a day one patch for this cutscene. <laughs> mud and simple beginnings. 20% off Rogue Energy using my code, the Apex Town, guys, would be greatly appreciated. I'd highly recommend checking it out. You can get yourself a starter kit for like 20 bucks less with my code. So uh, you might as well try it and see if you like it. I think you really will. I'm drinking pink lemonade today. And uh, yeah, I don't know why that cutscene was in like 10 frames a second, but let's do this thing. Oh, we're just racing, racing straight off the bat. Oh, I went early. Yikes. Now I am gonna suck at the start, guys. There's no doubt about it. We're gonna try our best. Oh, shit! That guy is gone. Okay, that's awesome. All right, we're on the podium positions as it stands, boys. I don't know how it works in MX. Is there like podiums and stuff? I used to be a big rally guy, but I never really got too much into like uh, the motorbike uh, motocross stuff. But I mean, they're fun to play. There's no doubt about that. I used to play all the Colin McRae games quite a lot and stuff like that as well. Okay, that was that was better. You got to go into the corners a little bit slow and then accelerate out of them is, is what I'm noticing. Up to second place, though. I'm going for it. Full send. Damn it, that didn't really work out, but it wasn't terrible either. All right, we're not too far behind first place here. Now, this is probably an easier difficulty. We're going to want to bump it up uh, when as we're getting better. Okay, you hold back the right stick when you're going over these is the play, I think. Final lap. Nice landing. Come on, let's get the dub. Let's get that dub, boy. See you later. We've taken the lead, son. For the first time, we're neck and neck. Wheel to wheel racing with Zach Phelps here, but we take the lead. Come on, he had to seat position there. Glorious stuff. <laughs> and yeah, this is fun, man. Woo! <laughs> Now, I believe I did play a little bit. Oh no, what am I doing? I believe I did play a little bit of that MX versus ATV game that was on um, PS4. Maybe, but I, I played a game that was similar to this anyway. But before that, it's been like Motocross Madness. I don't know if any of you guys remember that game. That game was so much fun. I loved it. All right, and that's gonna be a W in our first, uh, our first race, boys. I don't wanna speak too soon here, but it should be. It should be a W. Legend 998. Can I change my number and stuff? I'm guessing I probably can, because I do want to change that. Woohoohoo! We finished in first place, baby! Let's go. Coloring inside the lines. Finish a race without going off the track. Easy claps. Good girl, Lindy. Relax now. Relax, girl. All right. Beautiful stuff. My dog's freaking out here. Look at that. Look at those celebrations. You love it. You love to see it, baby. 26 points. Let's go. <laughs> awesome. Number 998. I need to change that, man. Ah, uh, here we can change it. Okay. Going for triple fives, because... 
Why the hell not? My favorite number. Legend 555. Five, five. I'm gonna put Apex. We are the Apex sound after all. No, we can't change. Oh, we can. Okay, it actually did change. Can I change the color and stuff? Okay, I don't think I, I can unlock any new gear just yet. Uh, that will come as we go. All right. Go back in. Speak to the team. All right, I got to back out and speak to the team. All right, team, what's happening here? So, yeah, they have a big open area here, which is like your hub world. You got your house. There's a lake down there. Um, it's just really cool. You can kind of go around. I did go down to the lake and I just absolutely went in there and crashed and drowned at the bottom of the lake, which was pretty funny. But that looks cool now, doesn't it? Apex 555. Hell yeah, baby. <laughs> Let's go. What's up, team? TJ Johansson. Hey, I uh, finally got your ATV repaired. There's an event this week. I was thinking of racing myself. Okay. Come. Might be a good way to get more fans. I'm sure Catherine would agree. Hell yes, dude. We got our ATV unlocked already. That didn't take long. Rainbow RSX 450 ATV. Okay. Continue your career. Awesome. I will definitely do that. So, um, we can go straight into ATV now if we want. No, we can't. I mean, I thought we could. Not yet, I guess. Uh, he did say later this week. So we got to do a, uh, got to do the North Pond Amateur first, right? We came first to Pine Hill Amateur. Now it's time for North Pond Amateur. Sounds good. Let's do it. I'm gonna turn the music off because I think I am probably gonna get copyrighted for that. What am I doing? I should have had the. I think I'm supposed to have like the brakes held at the at the start as well, or the clutch or something. Oh, there's two different routes to go here. I love those kind of ones. Look how high he went. Holy moly, he's gone. He is absolutely gone. He full sent it there. That wasn't terrible. It wasn't great, but it wasn't terrible. Oh my. Oh no! Dude, I'm dead. My guy's genuinely dead. I've never seen murder. That guy's bike landed directly on my skull. Oh my god. Jeez, lads. That was just not on, really, was it? <laughs> I think we need a red flag here. Good lord, man. An actual red flag is needed. What am I doing here? Okay, chill, chill. We need to chill it. That was not good. Damn it. I'm struggling now. All right, we're dead last. We're plumb last. Mainly because we got killed. Like, uh, I'm pretty sure my guy still has a concussion. So that would be a, a problem, but it is what it is. Now I know there's probably a lot of um, MX versus ATV players watching this that are probably really great at the game and know the game. So don't hate too much, guys, all right? Try giving me a few tips and pointers instead. I always prefer that. Because <laughs> I want to get better. I do want to improve. I know I suck right now, but you know, it's... um. A learning process it's the same thing with our red out game but that red out game is just tough like this game at least like you can kind of you know what you're doing off the bat there's not too much to it there is a high skill ceiling obviously but with red out like if you're if you're marginally off the pace you suck like here at least like i suck but at least i can still still race i'm not hitting the wall every two seconds or something like that okay this race was not our race we're plumb last Final lap, too. All right, we need to... Oh, my. Okay, let's restart. <laughs> let's restart. Because we've died twice now. We go, we go again, boys. I think you just got to be a little more patient. You got to wait it out. All right. Oh, my God. That guy got taken out bad. Ah, didn't quite make the down. Okay, now we're getting somewhere. We're actually launching on these jumps. Oh, no, no, no. Okay, we didn't go all the way back to plumb last this time, though, so we're still in the top half of people. Come on. Come on, baby. Look how long we just went there. Beautiful, okay. You can get a lot more distance in those jumps, man. What's up, boy? Okay, Freddy. You're the, you're the guy that got taken out at the start, I think, actually, Freddy. Or you're the guy that took someone out at the start. I can't remember which one. Bit of a major difference, to be honest, but... 
All right, we're getting much better at the jumps now, at least. I'm learning. I kind of got to go up and then back and over. Not so good there, though. Oh, my God. That guy just got sent to the moon. I love the crashes in this, dude. Yes, perfect. Can't ask for much more than that. Oh, shit. Oh, we just got away with that good landing there. All the way over. Yes, sir. Come on, Freddy. Come here, boy. Freddy boy. I'm coming for you, son. Oh, that's good racing. This is clean racing right now. We're on the podium as it stands. I want first place, though. I want second place. Probably not going to get first place. I got to be honest with you. Land that. Oh, it wasn't great, was it? It's a long way around there by going left, but it probably would be shorter if, you, if you're going to do that, mate. It's because you're taking it a lot more narrow, to be fair. Oh, oh, he went over. We're still battling for, um, we're still battling for third place here. Come on. Oh, got away with it. Not great. We're in fourth. You'd have to imagine this is probably the best we can do now after losing the people ahead. Need to keep the guy behind us, behind us. Can we make it? Oh, nearly. I think it's just nearly too hard to make it to that. Yes. This game is tense, boys. You have to be focused the whole time. Oh my god! Naya Weston around the outside just absolutely sent it over that hill. I did not send it there, though. Alright, we're fine. We're fine. If you're not gonna make the hill, sometimes it's better to just take it slow nearly, you know? Ah, uh, God, we're struggling. It's gonna take a little bit of getting used to, though, 100%. That was nice, though. Oh! Naya! We're gonna take fourth place from you! Perfect landing, too. God, oh, fourth place. Okay, we could have maybe got the podium there, but fourth place ain't terrible. We're about seven seconds off first. Uh, but yeah, that's a good challenge. I think it's on the right difficulty for me as it stands right now. We need to improve. We need to get better. And uh, yeah, that was fun. These races are really fun, actually. I, I enjoy them quite considerably. Oh, it shows us just off to the side clapping. We just missed out on the podium. 19 points, though. Not bad. So you still get a lot more points, uh in this for fourth than you would in like F1 or something. Um, so that's interesting. Okay. So we are still winning. Total number of points, 45. We're actually winning the uh, championship as it stands by one point. No, by 15 points. By 15 points over... Why the hell did a lot of those people get zero points there? And that's weird, right? That's strange. I don't understand that. I don't understand the point system in this game, so um, it doesn't seem like it's that similar to F1. I don't know. Maybe it is. I'll need to learn a little bit more about it. You guys can tell me in the comments as well. Oh, TJ hey, Johansson, what's up, buddy? TV. Go ahead and take it for a spin. It, this also means we could go out and race with others if you want. Okay. It's happening all the time, and oh, they don't stop you from still racing your bike on the weekends. Might be a great way to earn some extra fans. Mm hmm. Okay. How do I take it? Also, the first-person mode in this is kind of crazy. Like, watch this. Look. Like, look how crazy this is. <laughs> like, how cool is this? Let's go down to the lake here. Just watch this. Look. Oh, damn it. It didn't show me drowning. Last time it showed me, like, at the bottom of the lake drowning or whatever. Oh, we actually managed to survive this somehow. Oh. No. See, there we go. We're drowning. Down to the bottom of the lake we go, and we are dead. <laughs> we have drowned. All right, let's have a look at the uh, the career. We can go to our garage, and we can take out... Ah, so we can switch it here. Ah, yes. Oh, yes. We got our quad bike now, boys. Oh, yeah, dude. That's awesome. woo -hoo -hoo -hoo! Some of the camera angles you can get are actually really cool. Oh, we're dead. <laughs> All right, that's awesome. I kind of want to check out like the UTV as well. All right, let me check the UTV. That is a bad, bad thing. Look at this. This is awesome. Got ourselves a little buggy here. 
Okay, I love the way you can just explore your little hub world here as well. It does make it like a lot more interesting. It feels a lot more personable, I guess. Oh my god, are we gonna land this? Tell me we land this. <laughs> speed demon, reach a speed in excess of 80 miles an hour. Okay. I mean, that doesn't seem that crazy. Surprised we didn't reach that during a race, but I guess the bikes don't really go that fast around the track. Can we get to 100 miles an hour, maybe? We're out of bounds. We're out of bounds. There's a lot of collectibles, but the, some of them are pretty high up. How's the collectible in the middle of the lake there? How do you get that one? Did you guys just see that? There's got to be a way to get... Do we got to go over this little cliff here? And, like, go out to the... We got to go at speed, I think. Uh, okay. That's so cool. All right. We'll figure this out another time, though. Let's continue the career. Oh, we can do the first ATV uh, career. At Pine Hill, so that's week three. And what is this, week four? Okay, so we'll do it in order. Why not? I think that's the best way to do it. So we'll take the ATV out at Pine Hill. Let's do this thing. Our first ATV event. Here we go. Guys, please do drop a like if you enjoy the content as well. Do you want to see more of this? I'm actually really enjoying this game so far. I'd love to do more. Um, it just reminds me of like old school games kind of a little bit. I don't know why. Like, uh, I'm sure they have loads of games like these nowadays, but it just kind of reminds me of an old school fun goddamn motocross game. Oh, I was a slow starter right there. Like, look how hectic this is. How many is there? 16. Oh my god. Ed Kilpatrick storms out into the lead there. It's got to be an Irishman, surely. See ya, Ed. We got to pump the difficulty up, I think. I mean, I know we came for it in the last event, but... I'm going to be much better, I think, on the quads and the, and the car, because I'm used to off-roading with actual... Um, buggies and stuff like that, but I'm not really used to controlling bikes too much. I've never been as good with bikes in, in, in video games, even like video games like GTA. I've never been as good at controlling a bike as I am with a car because I've just naturally done the cars like I played Gran Turismo since I was a kid uh, and I didn't really play too many uh, bike ones apart from Motocross Madness, as I said. All right. Yeah, baby. Come on downtown. Easy W. All right, let's have a look at the settings, see what the difficulty is all about. Career difficulty semi-pro. Let's put it up to pro. I doubt it's going to adjust in-game, right? Until the next race. I would highly doubt it. It'd be kind of cool if I did, though. But, like, they're just suddenly on pro now and they're chasing me down. That would be kind of awesome. Where am I going, sir? <laughs> Dickhead. Uh, what am I doing? Oh my god, that guy absolutely launched. He's full sent that one. Wheel to wheel there with Silio Bakalov. See you, pal. No, no, no. That's cutting, cutting the goddamn track. We can't do that. That's illegal. We'll stay third, though. Oh, we kind of spun him out, yo. That was mean, but necessary. Nice, nice. Kind of early on the brakes there. Get out the way, boy. Whoa, I was spinning all over the place there. All right, there's three laps in this one. Let's try this. Let's try a little bit of first-person action on the quad, because this does seem insane. Like, first person just seems so chaotic. It looks like I'm kind of watching footage through a GoPro or something, doesn't it? Like, it looks, like, really, really well done. It's awesome. All right. Come on, baby. Yeah! Let's go. This is kind of awesome, actually, the first-person view. We're seven seconds ahead of second, so, yeah. We definitely needed to bump the difficulty up 100%. Even with that crash for seven seconds ahead, by the way, so we would probably be even further ahead without the mistake. But that's one thing that I do find, like, in these games. Like, I'll find if I turn the difficulty up, like, in racing games and stuff like that, I kind of play better to match the difficulty. Like, I I struggle if, like, the AI is bad, because I'm like, I kind of want to be doing wheel-to-wheel -wheel battles, so I'll kind of, like, fall back on purpose a little bit and end up making silly mistakes and doing, uh, doing silly stuff just to um, try and make it more interesting. Whereas if I have it on a hard difficulty and we're naturally just racing head-to-head, -head, I, I think it's a lot more entertaining for the video and um, 
and for myself as well, just from a stimulating point of view. But there you go. That's going to be an easy dub here in the first race. It's going to be very easy indeed. You can't ask for much more than that, my son. Oh my god, I've never been murdered in cold blood. We're actually going to not win this race now, watch. <laughs> this is what I mean about the AI, man. Like, I'll, I'll really make silly mistakes like that. We still are going to win, just, I think. I hope. But to be fair, it's half because of this bloody view. This view is nuts. He wins in the MX. He wins in the MTV. ATV, rather. MTV. <laughs> All right, let's go. Let's go. That's a W. Easy dub. 529. 26 points for your boy. Spencer Pickle comes in in second and gets uh, 23 points. Okay, so it's 26, 23, 21. 19 for fourth and then 18, 17, 16. Oh, it goes one all the way down then. See, F1 is kind of like 25 for the race winner. And then it goes like 18 for second, 15 for third, 12 for fourth. And and then it kind of gives one, one on from a, a ways down. All right, cool. All right, so we go to Lechuga Lakes in the MX. And we're on pro difficulty now as well, so it will be a lot tougher. I'm probably going to really struggle uh, with the bikes at first, particularly. Um, because as I said, I'm not quite as good with the bikes, but we'll get there, I think. I think we'll bloody get there, no problems. We'll learn. I'd prefer have it be harder at first and learn and get better and improve rather than have it easy and then kind of have to adjust the difficulty after. I wish there was like a countdown because I never know when it's about to go, uh, when it's about to go lights out and away we go kind of way. All right, that was a good first turn. Really good first turn. Oh, we lost him. We took the lead, actually. Hell yes, boys. Massive. They're right up my bum hole here as well. I have no idea where I'm going. Ah, oh, no. Had too much pace coming in there. But I think we can get away with it. Naya Watson. Come here, Naya. Come here, Naya. Oh, shit. This is what I'm talking about with the battles, boys. Oh, no. This is bad, though. I knew it. <laughs> I knew I wasn't landing that shit. God damn it. I think there's a specific way you got to land ones like that, because that went terribly very quickly. And we just dropped from first place to 11th place in the blink of an eye, man. But I'm going for it. I'm going for it. Full send. That was a terrible idea. What am I thinking? What was I thinking? I just got, I'm down in a goddamn valley. I'm restarting because they're going to find my body a few days later in the valley, for God's sake. Goodness me. All right. No worries. We're dead. We'll restart. I think we can, uh, we can do better. We were doing pretty well, to be fair. Just, you can't really make mistakes is the problem. And go. Oh, I, I let, I actually pressed it at the exact right time, but I let go by accident this time. <laughs> God damn it, how did I even manage that? Like, oh, that guy hit the pole, man. Oh, there's carnage at the start. Absolute carnage at the start here. And we somehow get into the lead for a brief moment, not for long. And it's all good. I need to learn how to like land those ones uh, where I'm coming from, uh, from high up rather than um, just waiting to hit the ground and dying miserably. I think I maybe just have to approach the turn a little differently. Well, approach the, uh... Like, see, how do I land this now without dying? Okay. We didn't die. We definitely took a hit. Definitely took some some time off it, but we didn't die. Okay, I'm gonna take the, uh, take the low road this time. We took the high road last time, and it miserably failed, so... Might as well take the low road this time. Oh my god, we're not gonna make it. Whoa! Bullshit! I'm rolling all the way back down the hill now. Come on, man. Oh, we were so near the the top as well. I don't know how I could have got further there. I feel like I did everything I could to, to get as far as possible, but maybe there's some button. I, I can't remember from the tutorial exactly of how to go a little bit further, but that really does suck. I thought I was doing decent there. We're back down to 10th again from first to uh, 
from first to tenth is not ideal, and that was not good either. We just slowed down so much to take that corner. I need to start braking before these corners rather than just letting uh, my foot off the gas, which is what I am doing. Oh, it's nearly perfect, you know. Through the water, up and around. Yeah. We just fell away badly in this race, unfortunately. That one mistake cost us too much. That was lovely. That was simply, simply lovely, I must say. Lovely. We overtake one person. Up into 10. We're back into the top 10. Come on, we need to get some points on the board at least. We can catch a couple more people. This is the final lap. They're pretty long laps though, so... Let's just go ahead and, and chase some fools down. We got loads of time to do so. Just try and limit the mistakes and and catch a few people at least. Nice. Nice. There you go. We caught up to the pack at least. We haven't overtaken any of them yet, but we caught up to the pack. Yeah, come on. Now we're cooking. Come on. Come on. The claps as we go by. We overtake two. Up into seventh position. No, see, they actually waited. I saw what they did. They just went up and over the hill and kind of went down the other side rather than trying to take the hill on. I see. Okay, now I'm learning more. All right, I see what they're doing. Is my bike damaged or something? All right, that's my last restart now, though. Even if I'm coming plumb last in this one, I'm still going to... I'm gonna do it because I've got kind of just learned now though I've learned a lot from what I've just done even so I feel like it's appropriate to restart one last time and kind of put all of my teachings into this one race here all of my learnings rather in second position as it stands right now yeah see the way okay he's like breaking before he goes up it which is the smart thing to do because then you don't end up going too high and you don't end up crashing I see, I see, I see. I understand now, Johnny boy. Some of these, you just don't want to do that, you know? No way! My bike went flying forward! Bullshit! Oh my god, my legs are broken. Oh! My feet are bent backwards, out of place, broken. Okay, that one, you just... I was just a millimeter off making that, I think. I feel like I should have made it, though. I don't know why I didn't make it. And we're down to 11th now. It's going to be me and this guy battling for last place here. Battling not to be last place, I might add. Because I would rather not be. I don't understand how we actually even make that one. At least he didn't either. There's so many guys up here. We could actually overtake quite a few people if we race well here. Like, there's no doubt about it. We just need to actually race well for the last lap here. And we could, uh... Get ourselves at least into the top 10 minimum. There we go. We're into the top 10 already. Now it's time to overtake a few more. Nope, we're back to 11th. Damn it, Steven! No! He hit my bike! You scumbag, man. We're going to be dead last now because of you. Damn it, man. We actually were going to get like 10th or 11th, but now we're coming plumb last. That really sucks. Ah! That sucks, man. I feel like I learned a lot coming last, though, you know? I learned a lot about what I need to do differently, and... Ah, okay. It's a little bit disappointing, but we learned a lot. I'd rather keep it on this difficulty and improve my way up. Off track. Okay. 11 points. So you still got 11 points for last position? It's saying everyone else is getting zero points, though. I don't understand that. Why did you not get points, guys, for coming first or whatever? Naya Weston and them. I'm confused. Sorry, buddy. Oh my god, he's in a movable- He's in a movable object! TJ! It's bloody- It's bloody Superman! Hey, hey, guess what just arrived in the mail? I got you a new suspension. Ooh. You're gonna need it, too. 
This rhythm race is all jumps. Oh god. All right, new suspension for the MX. Sounds good. The Phoenix suspension. Okay. It doesn't really show me if that improves uh, the car or not or anything though. Valis Wind Farms. Let's try it. Oh my god, this looks crazy. A special series of unique oh, okay. events. Sometimes similar to trails. They will Look test your skills in new ways and challenge you to become a better rider. For the next few weeks, you'll be participating in a rhythm invitational. Oh god. Focus on your jumps and landings. Feel the flow and find your lines and you'll do great. I suck at that though. Also, these cutscenes look like they're generally on PS1. Like genuinely, they look like they're on PS1. All right, guys, so I am incredibly stupid. I, I took a break, stopped recording, came back, didn't press record again, but I just went and done the whole video as if I was recording. I was talking through it and everything. Uh, but basically I won uh, the first UTV event by like 40 seconds. It wasn't even a challenge at all. And that's with the difficulty turned up to pro now as well. Um, well, I need to make sure that it is still because it seemed like so easy um, compared to the motorbike one. Anyway, it's like the difference is is night and day. It's a, it's incredible how much better we are on the um, in the UTV and the ATV than the motorbike. I think it's just a case of like I'm used to racing cars and used to racing uh, rally kind of things whereas at the motorbikes i don't really do as much as i said the only really motorbike game that i played was was motocross and and then i've done i've done very little else with motorbikes in general like even in gta i suck at driving the motorbikes compared to the cars and stuff but uh yeah we'll see if i can improve on the motorbike let me know like your number one tip to like improve on the motorbike i think it's mainly to do with like the way i'm landing the jumps or the way i'm kind of uh, the way I'm taking the jumps, maybe, because in the car and the, and the quad, that doesn't really matter as much. Uh, but we're going to do a UTV event here. I'll do the Black Bear run, seeing as you guys missed out on me doing the first one. And we'll do it on the pro difficulty or whatever, and we'll see if we can um, if we can win it. I'll make sure it is still on pro. Maybe it just changed it to, to pro for that one event or something. I need to make sure it is, because it did seem, like, incredibly easy uh, for a pro event. And I don't know if it was meant to be that easy or... I'm Maureen Bonner. Give me some, baby. Yeah, I'm an idiot. <laughs> but um, where where is the difficulty? Yeah, see, it is on pro difficulty slash hired. So yeah, like this is chaos though. There's so the 16 of them. Holy Christ! We are just penned in here. See the other one? I got. Uh, oh, sorry, buddy. Oh my God! This is just absolute chaos. This might actually make it more interesting now though, because. Um, We'll see if we can if we can gain on these fools. But yeah, I think the motorbike thing is just like it's a case of I need to get a lot more used to driving motorbikes in general. Uh, dude, you are just forcing me off the track there. That's fucked. There's 10 checkpoints. Okay, so this isn't even a lapped event here. Okay, interesting. We're back down to 15. Now we'll see how many people we can overtake. So um, this one has started a lot more poorly. The other one I got I got a line down the inside and kind of just absolutely sent it and took the lead early and just never gave it back at all. Um, we took the lead early and just stayed in the lead for a very long time. We, we are gaining past cars at a rapid rate here. See, this is what I mean. Like, look at this. We're going to be in first here, Asa. Like, these... What is that guy doing, man? <laughs> That's pro difficulty AI. What are you doing, pal? These guys just don't know how to drive U uh, UTVs, I guess. They are only, uh, only capable of driving uh, the motorbikes. The MXs, they ain't capable of the ATVs or the UTVs. Uh, but I think I think it's a, a mixture of both. It's like I'm more capable in the UTV and less capable in the bike, uh, like 100%. But we have taken the lead early here. We're three of 10 checkpoints, so it doesn't seem like this is going to be a particularly... Oh, this is cool. We're going across a big-ass bridge here. Oh, yeah, that's dope. I love that. This whole track is really awesome, though. I'm up the side of the cliff. We're going along the side of the cliff. Uh, one thing I don't really like the way when you turn it kind of pans the camera out like that I would prefer it kind of stay behind the car as you turn. Oh, we have a little few obstacles here Okay, I see you Not really you really do have to slow down for that, but that was pretty pathetic <laughs> All right, but yeah, we have a we have a decent lead now a sizable lead already. I kind of want to see what it's like in cockpit here Oh, I don't think I like this. Oh, I hate it I despise it, in fact. What is that view? Like, what is this view? It's kind of like a more cinematic view, I guess, but it's terrible. Yes, sir. Eat! 
Full send. Full send. Historic logging camp three. I kind of like the different cameras that they have. To oh no. Oh. Don't know how we got away with that. Extreme bird watching. <laughs> the hell's that for? Jump higher than 50 feet. Okay. Awesome. I'm going to platinum this game, boys. All right, we're well, five out of ten. How long are the checkpoints now? Okay, I swear we're going to have three within like a minute and then... Oh my god, Jesus, we're going to die here. Okay. <laughs> that was fun. <laughs> that is going to make this race maybe a little bit more interesting. No, they're not even close. Like, see how... See what I mean by how far ahead I am in the UTV? Like, it's not even remotely close. There was another checkpoint. Whereas in the uh, in the motorbikes, like the last two events I've done, I come twelfth and tenth. It's like, yeah, okay. There's a big difference, big skill gap uh, from motorbikes, the UTVs and the ATVs. Like I'm just so much better in them. Like it's probably because the amount of like, um, like Colin McRae games and dirt games I played in the past, like just ups my uh, ups my skill in these particular kind of uh, kinds of vehicles. Oh, this is cool. Through the little, uh, through the little bridge. I like this track a lot, man. This is so cool. Oh, it almost, that was not a, oh, my car's stuck. Uh, hello? Game? How do I reset? How do I reset? Don't do this. Don't do this. There's gotta be a way to reset or something. My car is stuck, guys! You gotta be shitting me right now! Is there a way to reset? Yes, okay, thank you. How am I still in first, by the way? I literally was stuck there for like 30 seconds. <laughs> How far ahead was I? Oh my god. Uh, they're still not even close either. I still can't even see them on the minimap. That's incredible. That is genuinely just quite incredible. Okay, now I see them. Now I see them. It's just way behind, though. Oh, this is awesome. Ch checkpoint number eight. Look at that view. Look at that view, son. To the top of the mountain we go, my friends. To the top of the mountain and beyond. Thank you very much, sir. Thank you. I don't know what, uh, why I would ever go to the left there, but... Here's the finish line. In all its glory, and that's going to be a win for me! Off the cliff. Woohoo! A W for your, for your boy! Back to back wins to start here. I can't believe we got stuck for goddamn like 30 seconds and we still won by 18 seconds in the end. I need to bump it up to world class for when I'm doing these events and then bump it back down to like semi pro for the bike events. <laughs> it's incredible the difference, but I hope you guys enjoyed this first look at MX versus ATV Legends. Uh, let me know if you're enjoying the game. Let me know if you want to see, uh, see this as a full series. All you got to do is drop a like, let me know in the comments and I will be happy to bring it to you. Um, we already have like 8% of the trophies, so I'm going for that platinum now, baby. Let's go. Now, nah, but for real, thanks for, thanks for watching guys i appreciate it and i'll see you guys next time peace out